Aerospace is actually the worst industry of all industries for women in the workforce. It tends to be about nine to 11 percent women, which I mean, that's bad. And so where are all the women? And so that's one of the things that we're passionate about at Venus. I mean, I can tell you when I started in aerospace, um, there's a plethora of young female engineers, but by the time they get to my age, which is early 40s, um, they're gone. And so something has happened culturally within the industry that means women, you know, flee. I was recently at an event where I was asked to be one of the speakers, um, and it was a long day of founder after founder after founder speaking. Um, as the day went on, I was like, there hasn't been a single female. And when I walked up on stage about you know, four o'clock in the afternoon, and this had started at 8 a.m., I was the very first female founder on stage at this entire event. I walked up there and literally someone in the audience said, oh, it's a woman. And I thought, what is wrong with the industry? Like, where are the females? Why, why aren't more women out here doing this? It's just frustrating to watch these very talented women who could have incredible careers end up deciding to go elsewhere because there just aren't great options for them. And I do think it comes down to culture. You know, it doesn't work. As a mom, I can't have a Thursday night meeting at 9 p.m. And I have lived in an industry where that is the norm. We have two daughters. And so it's important for us to be home for dinner, to get them to soccer and swim team and to um, be a family. Um, while it's also important for us to build this incredible product. And so we want that for our employees too. And so we're hoping that Venus can be that place that can be a family-friendly, female-friendly organization that means everybody can bring their best selves here.